This field here in Fredericksburg, Texas is part of the world's largest working wildflower farm and the blue bonnets are having a banner season. Well, I've seen a 10 and I've seen a two, but this year I'm predicting we're about an eight. John Thomas knows a thing or two about farming. I'm a fourth generation farmer and I love to grow things. Especially blue bonnets. It's very risky, it's very hard to do, but uh, that's my challenge and I've been doing it for 54 years. It's all about getting the right weather at the right time. We want a hot, dry summer. I think we can check that box last summer. And a cold, wet winter preceded by some fall rains in like October, November. Got a little dry on us around December, but thank goodness around latter part of February, first of March, we started getting some showers. And March showers are bringing all the flowers at the perfect time for crowds here at Wild Seed Farms, the Thomas family's business. It's the flowers and the butterflies. Five-year-old Avery and her mom, Soka, like the farm's red poppies, but they love the blue bonnets. I think the color, it's, you know, the Texas flower, you know, and, you know, we're here in Texas, so I just love it. And they're also a photographer's dream. I have taken some pictures where places are just covered with them, and it's fun to find them, but they're really good to see here. The more blooms, the more seed. So we will harvest this in about a month and a half and collect seed off of this big field and process the seed, bag the seed, and sell the seed. Here's what the harvest looks like as a big combine combs through the field. About half the seed is harvested with the other half dropping back into the field for future years. You know, it depends on the year, but we produce anywhere from 50 to uh, 60, 70,000 pounds of blue bonnet seed. That's more than anyone else in the world. Well, we tell everybody that Texas, we put on the largest flower show on earth in April. So come for the eclipse and stay for the flowers. I do love blue bonnets. In Fredericksburg, Chicago Windler, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.